हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द चैनल टुडेज क्वेश्चन इज के स्मोलेस्ट एलिमेंट इन अ बीएसटी इफ यू आर न्यू टू द चैनल प्लीज कंसीडर सब्सक्राइबिंग वी सोल्व अ लॉट ऑफ इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन ऑन दिस चैनल एंड दैट कैन डेफिनेटली हेल्प यू विद योर इंटरव्यू द क्वेश्चन इज गिवन अ बाइन रिसर्च ट्री राइट अ फंक्शन के स्मोलेस्ट टू फाइंड द के स्मोलेस्ट एलिमेंट इन इट यू मे अज्यूम के इज ऑलवेज वैलिड एंड वी आर गिवन विद एग्जाम्पल एंड इफ यू लुक एट एग्जाम्पल नंबर वन you can clearly see the smallest element is 1 and it is asking that we need to return the first smallest element so that's why we are returning 1 and if you look at example number 2 we are given with the bst and k is 3 that means we need to return the third smallest element and if you look from here 1 2 and 3 so 3 is the third smallest element so let's move on to the pen and paper let's see how we can solve this question after that we will see the code I have taken the example given in the question, and the question is asking us that we need to find the kth smallest element in the given BST. Let's first talk about BST. Binary search tree. Binary search tree is a tree in which the left node is less than root, and the right node is greater than root. That means if I have one, two, three. Then one will gonna be on my left, two will gonna be on my right, three will gonna be on my right. So this is how BST works. That on the left we have the smaller value than the root, and on the right we have a larger value than the root. And we have three form of traversal: in order, pre order, and post order. In in order. we first go to left then root then right in pre order we first go to root then we go to left then we go to right and in post order first we go to left then we go to right and then we go to root and if i say that i will going to traverse this tree in in order that means first i will go to left so our left is 1 then i will go to root our root is 2 then i will go to right and our right is 3 in this case you can see i am getting the nodes in the ascending order which means the first element is the smallest element second element is the second smallest element and the third element is the third smallest element and this is what we are going to use in this question so if i use the example given in the question then if i do in order on this tree then first element i will get is 1 then i will get 2 then i will get 3 and then i will get 4 because first of all i will go to the left and i came here i don't have left then i go to root i showed the root then i came to right then i again going to the main root then i'm going to the right so this is what i got from first row and if i say k is equal to 2 in that case i'm simply going to return the element that k minus 1 index which is so if i talk about this tree 2 is the second smallest element and if i say my k is equal to 1 that means i'm going to return value at index k minus 1 which is zeroth index which is 1 so 1 is the first smallest element and if i talk about this tree again first i will go to 1 then i will go to its root then i don't have right then i will go to 3 then i will go to 4 then i will go to 5 and then i will go to 6 this is how i will going to traverse this tree in in order and if i say my k is equal to 3 then i will going to return k minus 1 index and then i am simply going to return 3 so 3 is my third smallest element 
So now the question is, how I can write the code for this? So simply, I'm going to use a helper function in order in which I will simply, if my root is null, then I'm going to return a empty list. Else, I'm going to return left plus root plus right. And on left and right, I'm going to use my in order. And at the end, I'm simply going to return in order root and k minus 1 because we need the k minus 1th index because we are storing in the list from the 0th index and if I am asking for the third smallest element that means the third smallest element lies on index 2 which is k minus 1 so let's move on to the coding part let's see what is the code for this problem let's see the code so I made a helper function in order and if root is none I am simply going to return a empty list and then I am calculating my in order of the left and my in order of the right and then I am simply adding in order my value of root in a list and I am adding in order of the right and at the end I am simply returning k minus 1 the index element because in a list we store element from index 0 and if I am asking for the k smallest element that means the k smallest element will gonna exist on k minus 1 index. So this was the code. Let's see whether it works or not. So here I submitted my code and it got accepted. So this was the solution for this video. If this video was helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much guys for watching the video. Please don't forget to subscribe.